How did the Treaty of Tordesillas divide the New World? The Treaty of Tordesillas was a significant agreement signed on June 7, 1494, between the kingdoms of Spain and Portugal. It aimed to settle conflicts arising from the explorations and discoveries of the New World by Christopher Columbus and other European explorers. Here is a detailed history of the events leading to the treaty and its impact on the division of the New World. Age of Exploration In the late 15th century, European powers were eager to find new trade routes and resources. Spain and Portugal emerged as leading maritime nations, with explorers like Christopher Columbus, Vasco da Gama, and Ferdinand Magellan undertaking voyages to expand their empires. Papal Bulls In 1493, Pope Alexander VI issued two papal bulls known as the Bulls of Donation. The first, Interquitera, granted Spain the rights to explore and colonize any territories west of a line drawn north-south, 100 leagues west of the Azores and Cape Verde Islands. The second bull, Dudum Siquidem, issued a few months later, amended the line to 270 leagues west of Cape Verde. Portuguese Concerns The Portuguese were alarmed by the Spanish claims, as they had been exploring the Atlantic coast of Africa for trade routes. They argued that the line drawn in the Bulls of Donation would give Spain a significant advantage, leaving Portugal with limited access to the newly discovered territories. Negotiations To avoid a potential conflict, the Spanish and Portuguese monarchs, King Ferdinand II of Aragon and Queen Isabella I of Castile, and King John II of Portugal, agreed to meet in the town of Tordesillas in 1494 to negotiate a division of the New World. The Treaty On June 7, 1494, the Treaty of Tordesillas was signed. It moved the line of demarcation 370 leagues west of Cape Verde, allowing Portugal to claim territories located east of the line, while Spain gained rights to territories west of the line. This division gave Portugal control over Brazil and parts of Africa, Asia, and the Pacific, while Spain obtained most of the Americas. Consequences, the Treaty of Tordesillas was significant in shaping the subsequent colonial territories and influence in the New World. Portugal focused on its holdings in Brazil and established a vast empire in Africa and Asia, including territories in India and Southeast Asia. Meanwhile, Spain gained control over present-day Mexico, Central and South America, and much of the Caribbean. Challenges and adjustments, over time, various European powers, including England, France, and the Netherlands, challenged the Spanish and Portuguese monopoly in the New World. These challenges led to conflicts, wars, and the eventual decline of the Spanish and Portuguese empires in the Americas. Legacy The Treaty of Tordesillas laid the groundwork for subsequent European colonization in the Americas and the establishment of colonial empires. It contributed to the cultural, linguistic, and social influences that persist in Latin America today. Understanding the history of the Treaty of Tordesillas helps shed light on the early European colonization of the New World and its far reaching consequences. Thanks for watching, please like and share this video. Also hit the subscribe button, ring the notification bell, and let's embark on a journey of knowledge together.